will use the count if formula to count the number of times blue is listed. So here we have a set of data and I have blue already highlighted so it will be easy to see. So now we will add our count if formula. So now we have our range here. And then our criteria criteria would be E4. So now we drag our formula to formula down and now we see blue is listed three times one two and three now we will edit our count if formula to count in sequential order the number of times blue is listed meaning it will show the first second and third time blue is listed. So here is our formula. Our range from E4 through E11. Now the change we will make is with the range. So the formula that we will add to F4 our range would be through E4 and we will make the first E4 static meaning it will not change. Now our criteria would be E4. Now what this formula is telling you that the range will now be dynamic. At first our range was E4 through E11. So the formula that we will enter in G4, the range would be E4 through E4. Now when we copy the formula down, the range would then change and will be E4 through E5, which you can see right here. So that is the change that we made to the formula. So now if we copy the formula down again, you see our range is from E4 through E6. And if we copy the formula all the way down, we can see the number of times blue is listed in order the first, second, and third time it is listed. And that is how you can use the count if formula to count in sequential order. Thank you for watching. Leave a comment, like this video, and subscribe.